G'day, it's Bill Stenner here from Optics Central. Today we're unboxing a new, uh, a new telescope. It's the Skywatcher 130AZ GTE, which is, uh, it's basically, it's a Newtonian, it's a 130 Newtonian, with, which has got a nifty little uh, go-to mount. So here it is, it's in a box, I'll just get into it. This is my favorite bit. Okay, it's a box of boxes. Let's not drop this one. You can go over there. Okay, this. What I'll do is I'll, I'll, I'll lay things out on the floor and then I'll build the whole thing because we're going to have to change the camera angles. Uh, let's see. Judging by the size of the box, this is probably the legs. Yes, indeed. Packing, packing, packing. Here we have the tripod legs. Just put that there. Uh, we've got the accessory tray. The accessory tray goes there. This, this is very important. It's the uh, uh, it's the, uh, the the mount extender. What happens is the 130, the Newton, uh, uh, the Newtonian 130 is fractionally longer than is uh, is is needed. And if you if you're in exactly the wrong position, you can bang the Newtonian against one of these legs here. So we uh, so this thing is to just increase it, the height of it to give you that clearance. What else have we got here? Oh. The 130AZ GTE comes with a red dot. It's a, a red dot is like a finder scope, which you will just uh, find. If it has a zero magnification, it's like a heads-up display for your car. Um, I'll show you how that goes in a minute. The instruction manual, very important. Here we have the guts of the whole system. Now what this is, is, if we get it right, up the right way, it sits on top of that, actually on top of the, 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 the pedestal, and uh, the telescope bolts onto this guy, and you, you, well, the only thing that you need to do with this is put electricity into it. It's got a, a Wi-Fi built in, which means that um, you, can you can use it with your mobile phone, which is the great thing about that is you don't have to touch it, which means that you don't have to shake the scope. And the scope itself, by a process of elimination, is in this box. Oops. That's badly done. This is the part I don't want to drop. So much packing, there's boxes within boxes. Okay. Now I'm going to pause because there's a customer. <laughs> Just have to turn the videos off. Thank you. Okay, here we are. We've uh, moved from the uh, from the floor over there. Uh, I've got them in bits and pieces here in uh, on the counter. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them together on the, the, the tripod, which is here. Um, the first thing I'm going to do, though, is... Uh, actually, I may not do this. This is the, 
uh, the accessory stand and it, and it goes down there, it's probably out of shot, so I won't bother with that. I'll just put that there. Okay, let's see. The first thing that goes on is the pier extender, which goes on here. I'll just tighten this. It's nice and steady. And then uh, this is the top of the pier adapter, and it goes onto the bottom of the mount. And in the same way, it's all pretty simple, really. Right. And then the, these two parts go together. Uh, just make sure that one of them is lined up like that. There's a, there's a, small, a small triangle there that you just make, it, make sure one of them matches up. Just make sure that they're nice and tight. It's good and sturdy. Uh, and now the telescope tube will go onto there. One last thing, uh, thing, the red dot adapter goes onto the, the top of the tube like that. If you don't know how to use a red dot adapter, I've, uh, I've written a blog about it at some stage. Um, they're actually quite nifty. It's a little heads-up display, like your car. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're back. We're, um, uh, I've, I've put some batteries in the mount. Uh, I've turned the mount on. I'll just check. Yes, the mount's on. It's flashing, uh, waiting for some... Connectivity. Um, now, this, this mount is particularly good because we, it, it, it connects wirelessly to your mobile phone. What happens is you download the SynScan app. It's, a, it's an Altazimuth app, so you don't need the Pro. You just get the standard in SynScan app. Once that's going, um, you have to dial up to, uh, to rate 9, and let's see. There you go. How's that? Right, and then it becomes exactly like any other any other of the SynScan go to um, uh, go to mounts. So yeah, that's basically it, I think. So um, thanks for watching.